Hello students, today I am going to start exercise 1e. So before starting this exercise, I am providing you some important formula related with this exercise and previous exercise 2. So keep watching, first formula, then I am going to solve each and every question from exercise 1e. Try to understand properly, share with your friends and don't forget to like the video. Keep watching. This one for previous exercise a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square similarly a minus b whole square is equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square similarly a square plus b square we have two formula of a square plus b square one is a plus b whole square minus 2ab and another is a minus b whole square plus 2ab according to condition we have to use this formula a square minus b square formula a plus b a minus b now i am providing you uh, that formula where we have to use in exercise 1 e now in this exercise we have to use this formula so look at properly this formula a cube plus b cube you can copy this formula a plus b a square minus a b plus b square similarly a cube minus b cube a minus b a square plus a b plus b square similarly a plus b whole cube formula a cube plus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube next a minus b whole cube formula a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square minus b cube these are the formula and now we have to use a cube plus b cube a cube minus b cube in exercise 1 e so learn this formula properly let's take a start exercise 1 e exercise 1 e question number 1 a 1000 plus a q first of all look at this question 1000 plus a q we have to convert this in the form of a q plus b q 1000 we have to convert in the form of a q so we can write 10 q plus a q this is in the form of a q plus b q now what is the formula of a q plus b q a plus b it means 10 plus a a plus b after that a square 10 square minus a b a means 10 b means a plus b square means a square okay you can write the formula here a cube plus b cube what is the formula of a cube plus b cube a plus b a square minus a b plus b square in the place of a what is here 10 in the place of b what is here a so a plus b it means 10 plus a after that a square it means 10 square minus a b a b means 10 into a b square in the place of b what is here a so a square now just solve this one 10 plus a 10 square means 100 minus 10 a plus a square hope you understand this question keep watching look at next b number you can do it uh, m cube plus 8 so m cube plus 2 cube you can do this uh, i'm going to do question number c 8 x power 3 plus 27 y power 3 this q for x only not for 8 this q for y only not for 27 okay so we have to convert in the form of whole cube in the place of 8 we have to write 2 x whole cube plus 27 means 3y whole cube now this one in the form of a cube plus b cube now we have to use formula of a cube plus b cube okay now in the place of a what is here 2x in the place of b what is here 3y formula is written here a cube plus b cube formula a plus b a square minus a b plus b square so same formula in the place of a what is here 2x in the place of b what is here 3y so we have to write here 2x plus 3y a plus b a plus b after that a square in the place of a what is here 2x so 2x whole square 
minus a b minus a means what is here 2x b means what is here 3y plus b square plus in the place of b what is here 3y so 3y whole square okay 2x plus 3y 2 square 4x square minus 3 into 2 6xy plus 3 square means 9y square hope you understand this question also a and c and after that i'm going to do question number f number d and e also in same process you have to convert uh, and do if you have any confusion you can comment look at question number f 27 x cube y cube plus 64 now first of all we have to convert both in the form of whole cube 27 means 3 cube means 27 so 3 x y whole cube we have to write 3 cube means 3 into 3 into 3 means 27 plus 64 means we can write 4 cube 4 cube means uh, 64 4 into 4 into 4 means 64 okay now this is in the form of a cube plus b cube and the formula is a plus b a means 3 xy 3 xy plus 4 and after that a square 3 xy whole square minus a b a b 3 xy into 4 plus b square 4 square 3 xy plus 4 3 square means 9 x square y square minus 4 into 3 12 x y plus 4 square means 16 okay up to here you can understand properly after this look at question number h x power 9 plus y power 9 this one is little bit different x power 9 plus y power 9 look at here properly how to do this one first of all we have to convert in the form of whole cube so x power 3 whole cube plus y power 3 whole cube that's why it will be 9 3 into 3 9 3 into 3 9 now this in the form of a cube plus b cube use formula a plus b a means x cube b means y cube a plus b and after this a square x cube a means x cube whole square minus a b a b x cube y cube plus y square y cube is here square now we have to use this formula again a cube plus b cube formula again once write down same x cube plus y cube this one solve x power 6 minus x cube y cube plus y power 6 okay now look at this one no need to do anything no need to factorize this one just we have to use formula again what is the formula of x cube plus y cube we know that x plus y x square minus x y plus y square and this one remaining x plus 6 minus x cube y cube plus y power 6 hope you understand this question properly uh, after this look at next number number j question number j in this video you will get question number one only in next video you will get question number two try to understand properly if you have any confusion you can comment and ask me first of all we have to convert both in the form of a cube plus b cube so we can write one by x whole cube minus one by y whole cube this is in the form of a cube minus b cube in the place of a what is here one by x in the place of b what is here one by y so same formula we have to use one by x minus one by y a minus b and after that a square one by x whole square plus a b one by x into one by y plus b square one by y whole square now just write down formula a cube minus b cube formula a minus b a square plus a b plus b square in the place of a 1 by x in the place of b 1 by y so 1 by x minus 1 by y here 1 by x square this is square for 1 also for x also 1 is square 1 x square x square plus 1 into 1 1 by x y plus 1 by y square 
you can leave up to here also or after taking LCM also you can do but leave up to here or you can take LCM okay so this question is up to here now you can see the next I'm going to do question number M M some questions remaining you can do yourself try to understand this basic concept then you can do other questions too look at this one properly this one a little bit lengthy and this one is last question of this uh, video of exercise 1e from number one a two number i will upload in next video okay this one in the form of a cube this one in the form of b cube in the place of a what is here 2a plus b in the place of b what is here 2a plus 2b it means a cube plus b cube you have to use formula a plus b a means what is here 2a plus b plus b means a plus 2b this one a plus b happened okay after this a is square formula formula i am going to write formula again here you have to remember formula a plus b a square minus a b plus b square look at properly a here this one is b a means this one b means this one a plus b means a plus b after this what is here a square a means 2a plus b 2a plus b whole square minus a b a means this one b means this one multiply we have to multiply write down downside no place there 2a plus b a plus 2b plus b square b means what is here a plus 2b a plus 2b whole square now this 2a plus a these two are like terms so we can add 3a b plus 2b we can add this 3b okay now we have to use here formula this one is a little bit lengthy but you can understand properly a plus b whole square formula we have to use here a square plus 2 a b plus b square minus this two we have to multiply we have to write inside bracket only afterwards we have to open the bracket 2a into a 2a square 2a into 2b 4ab plus b into a ab plus b into 2b 2b square plus of the bracket okay now a plus b whole square formula we can use a square plus 2 a b plus b square means 2 b whole square now 3 a plus 3 b 4 a square 2 square 4 a square plus 2 plus 4 a b plus b square now open the bracket minus 2 a square this two we can add 4 a b plus a b 5 a b and plus minus minus 5 a b minus minus plus minus 2 b square plus this one write down a square plus 2 into 2 4 a b plus 2 square means 4 b square okay you have to practice two three times two three times uh, it will be easy for you this question is very important for four marks 3a plus 3b now look at here 2a square a square is here 4a square is here first of all arrange 4a square plus a square minus 2a square like term we have to arrange first after that b arrange b square is here minus b square is here plus b so plus b square minus 2b square plus 4b square after that ab arrange 4ab is here 4ab is here plus 4ab plus 4ab another ab is not here now here is minus 5a minus 5a another a only no now b only b b is not there okay uh, why not be here okay this much now 3a plus 3b now we have to solve this 4 plus 1 5 and 5 minus 2 means we get how much 3 so we have to write down here 3 this one question number m
5 a square here 4 plus 1 5 5 minus 2 3, 3 directly write on 5 plus uh, 4 plus 1 5 5 minus 2 means 3 here also 3 only 4 plus 1 5 5 minus 2 means 3 plus 3b square plus 8ab minus 5a okay ab uh, here is b i think here is 4ab plus ab it will be 5ab here is b b is missing there b so just 3a plus 3b 3a square plus 3b square and when you subtract this we get plus 3ab here is 5b is remaining here because 4ab plus ab means 5ab 5ab and this minus minus plus minus so it will be minus so we have to write 5ab 5ab now what is common here 3 common remaining a plus b and from here also 3 common what is remaining here a square plus ab plus b square now look at properly this one 3 into 3 9 a plus b a square plus ab plus b square this one is the answer uh, this one is a little bit uh, lengthy so you feel confusion you have to practice two three times so you can understand properly nothing is here just we have to use a plus b a cube plus b cube formula and here we have to use a plus b whole square a plus b whole square formula this two we have to multiply and at first you have to use a cube plus b cube formula so you have to learn formula you will get four marks this question is very important and question number n also same in this process you have to do um, if you have any confusion in question number one you can upload when i will make video of question number two next day i will upload some question from one if you have any kind of confusion please comment thanks for watching till last wait for next video for question number two